here's what's gonna happen. We're gonna go through a bunch of extremely zoomed in credit cards and I'm gonna slowly zoom out. Whenever you think you know which credit card it is, make a buzzing sound and take a guess. And for everyone else watching, feel free to play along. If you guess correctly, you'll earn a point. You can buzz in as much as you want. However, every answer you get wrong, you'll lose a point. The winner of this game is gonna get a special prize and the loser is going to have to publicly share their credit score. And today who's joining me is my co-host CJ, or you might know him as the tropical shirt guy. Matt, our first contestant, the guy with the fetish for Alaska Airlines, and our second contestant, Stanley the Credit Frog, the only credit card YouTuber who actually likes Bank of America. And finally, we have Josh, the guy that spends too much time editing. But let's just go ahead and get this started. This is gonna be card number one, and I'm gonna be slowly zooming out. Buzz in whenever you feel like you know the answer. No answers. This. This is a little bit more cautious because you will lose one point if you do get it wrong. Right. <laughs> They're like, uh, they want to be sure before they buzz in. <laughs> right. It's like crickets. Come on, guys. Buzz. buzz. Oh, we have Joshua. All right, Josh, what is your answer? Venture one. That is extremely close, uh. but it is not the venture one. Buzz. Stanley, what is your answer? Capital one venture. CJ, is it the Capital One Venture? You know what? I think Stan fed off of Josh's answer, so hey, we're gonna give it to him. All right, so what do we have now? We have Stanley, the Credit Frog, at one point. Yeah! And then we have Josh at negative one. Joshua, how do you feel right now? Uh, you know, I'm not feeling the best, but uh, hopefully I can redeem myself. This is gonna be card number two. We're zooming out. Remember to buzz in when you know the answer. You know, I'm going to predict, I'm going to predict that maybe Stan will get this one. I have no idea though. Buzz. We have Stan. He buzzed in. Stan, what is your answer? Uh, okay. It's the City Rewards Plus credit card. That is absolutely correct. And I just totally guessed that Stan would get it. You're giving an advantage. The only reason why I know this card is because one of my family members wanted this particular card. And I was like, I've never heard of this before. So it seems like Dan Lee is taking the lead. He might take the whole game. Well, Matt, I know uh, Josh is at negative one, but Matt, you're still at zero. You haven't buzzed in. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just trying not to get last place here. So I'm being conservative. You have to show that credit score card number three. Oh boy nobody buzzed yet <laughs> this is my favorite spot to look at this card <laughs> no buzzes buzz oh we have one Stanley what is your answer it's the American Express platinum card oh CJ is it the American Express platinum card I, I don't know is Stan sure Stanley are you sure I believe I'm sure yes I'm sure oh, he believes that he's I'm sure, sure. Okay. I believe I'm sure yes I'm sure <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, okay sure he, he like CJ. tripled down All on right. that one you know what Stanley you are correct that's the one by Julie Meritu you don't get bonus points stop being so smart I think he, Matt could easily get this one what do you think CJ oh I think so well let's go on Card number four. Come on, guys. Oops. You know this Very one. Very cautious. They're like afraid to lose points. Buzz, 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 buzz. Oh, we have a buzz from Matt. Capital One Quicksilver. So, you know, because I'm so diabolical. Here. We do know I did a video not too long ago and there are several versions of this credit card. So Matt, which one is it? <laughs> Ooh, uh, you know, I'm not going to get, I'm not going to take the negative point. So I'm not going to guess on that. Really? Come on. Maybe we'll just accept his Quicksilver answer. <laughs> All right, Matt, you got, you got the point. All right. I'll take it. Thank you. Nice. Nice. I, I couldn't buzz in because there's like eight different versions of this card. Right. He got it right on the first try. So it worked out for him. I tried to confuse him. CJ, you scoundrel. I know. I know. I'm so bad. I I'm not sure if anybody will get this card. However, I did research on this card and it's actually a pretty good card. You know what? I'm gonna put one penny down on Joshua. That's so much confidence I have that oh, he'll geez. get it. All right, I'm zooming out. Come on, Joshua, I want my penny. Half of the logo there. Come on, Joshua, I want my penny. Come on. <laughs> come, come on, Josh, Josh. come on. <laughs> Man, I think I'm gonna lose my penny. Most of the logo is showing at this point now. We have crickets. NFC tag. Come on, Joshua. Card. All right. Are we starting to get words? We're starting to get words? All right. At this point, come on. He's like, uh, I'm not doing it. 
Buzz. There he is. It's Joshua. What is your answer? The Kroger credit card. That is absolutely correct. Yes, I get to keep my penny. Thank you so much. Have you ever seen this card before? I had no idea what this card was, but I saw the G and that was a giveaway. So with this card, it's really interesting. It's a World Elite MasterCard and it gets 5% back on mobile wallet purchases for the first $3,000, 1% afterwards, 2% at Kroger's, and 1% back on everything else, all with no annual fee. Wow. Right. That's a lot. For $3,000, what, every year, every month, every quarter? Every year. We do not have Kroger's in New Jersey, as far as I'm aware, so. There's no Kroger's in California, at least where I'm from in California. I've never been inside one. Huh. So you just guessed it? That's crazy. Yeah. All right. Uh, so Josh is currently at zero points. He redeemed himself. Making some headway. In the right direction. There you go, Josh. And I get to keep my penny. Thank you so much. Oh, right. Yeah, I forgot you bet that penny. <laughs> I need to stop. CJ um, doing side bets over here? I know. I like guessing who's going to get it. And so far, I have two for two. Card number six. Nobody buzzing in yet. Come on, guys. It sort of looks like an LCD TV screen, you know? Right, it, it did. Right. They're probably like, what are you showing me at the moment? Buzz. Buzz. Oh, oh, we have, wait, I don't know who came in first, so, oops. I definitely came in first. Stanley, what is your answer? The Delta Reserve 747 edition. Yeah, that's absolutely correct. So Stanley, why, how did you know? Oh, because he has it. I mean, as soon as it got to like some kind of white on the card, I was like, yep, that's it. So we're going to go on to card number seven. All right, I'm zooming out. Buzz. Oh, right. What? Josh? See? <laughs> <laughs> right? <laughs> Josh, what is your answer? Bank of America travel reward. Oh my god. <laughs> well, you can tell by CJ's reaction. That is absolutely correct. Hell yeah. Good job, Josh. Nice, Josh. This is going to be the bonus round. Ready? Oh, jeez. What is this? <laughs> what is this? All right. I'm zooming out. It's like my 60 minute ta time effect. <laughs> <laughs> What's the Jeopardy sounds like? Buzz. Oh, we have a buzz. Is that a picture of me? <laughs> that is absolutely That's correct. Amazing. Remember to subscribe to everybody. Well, Matt, I'm happy you got yourself. So now you're at two. You're still in second place. Look at that. Putting Joshua back in dead last. Unreal. We're going to go on to card number eight. All right. I'm zooming out. This one might be hard. I mean, nobody is buzzing in yet, so... It's that lost point. Like, it really puts you, you know, thinking. Mm-hmm. <laughs> They're still thinking. Oh, God. I can see, like, steam coming out of their brains. They're like, what the heck can this be? I know I've seen this. <laughs> right? It's a very popular card. Getting there. Let's see a little bit of words. Buzz, buzz, buzz. Matt, what is your answer? U.S. Bank Altitude Go. Matt, if you can see my face right now. <sighs> Unfortunately, it is not, and I have to take a point away from Matt. Buzz. Josh, what is your answer? U.S. Bank Cash Plus. I mean, we're just going down the list of U.S. Bank cards at the moment. First, Matt said whatever it was. He said Altitude Plus, I think it was. Now here comes Josh with Bank Cash Plus. <laughs> <sighs> Joshua, you are correct. Oh, hell yeah. Nice, Josh. That is uh, what my answer was going to be, too. But I just, that one point off is just, it's killer. You know, you just can't just throw out your own answers there. But I mean, Dan, you have like the lead. You can, you can wager a couple points here. You don't have to hold on to them so tightly. <laughs> Yeah, come on, Stan. <laughs> well, Josh is catching up to you. Let me tell you this right now. I'm not worried. Oh, okay, Stanley. <laughs> Shots fired. All right, we're going to go on to card number nine. CJ wish he could buzz in right now. I totally do. What is it? Clouds? Look at it those. It just looks like a nice vacation, right? I know. It looks so tropical. <laughs> It's got partly cloudy skies. There's a palm tree branch. Nobody is buzzing in. Right? We have like most of the card at this point. Nobody is buzzing in. Guys, what is going on? <laughs> I'm just going to say you guys are offending me right now. I am taking this personal. Right. You're making CJ oh. cry. <laughs> Very personal. I don't know what this is. I have Man. no idea what this is. Oh my God. <laughs> <I know. laughs> 
All right, all right, this is ridiculous. Buzz. Uh, Stanley, what is your answer? This is not great. Um, Discover It. Would you take that answer? Nope, because there are different versions of Discover It. Oh. All right, we're going to keep doing that. <laughs> Sorry, Stan. Anybody else? They're like, uh, we're not doing this. We're not playing this game. <laughs> Basically, the car's all showing at right now. Come on, Matt. All right. All right, the car's all... <laughs> Buzz. All right, Joshua. You know, it's going to be a wild guess here. Um, you know, I have no idea. I've never seen this card in my life. I'm going to guess that it is the Discover It student. Mm. CJ, is it the Discover It student? You guys know I love Discover It, right? So, Joshua, you, you just oh. hurt my feelings, man. Come it, it is on. not the Discover It student. Dude, what is this card? Like, <laughs> I don't want to know this card, like, at all. All right, do we have any more guesses, or are we just going to move on? Is Matt just going to be safe? I actually do not know this card, so I'm just going to play it safe, not take the negative. All right, it is the Discover It Miles card. Oh, cool. Never heard of it. <laughs> nope, never heard of it. What? Oh, God, CJ, <laughs> CJ, you're not what? doing a good job. What do you mean? I mean, granted, and I've never actually covered the Discover It Miles because it doesn't stand out to me, but I know about the card. You know, I I thought for a long time it was like the Hawaiian Miles card. That's what I thought it was. I was actually gonna guess the Discover It student, just like right. Josh, if I would have guessed. So <laughs> it's so interesting that you decided to guess that way because like there's a tropical paradise. I don't think any college student can afford to go there. So the Discover It Miles, there's no annual fee. Like with a lot of Discover cards, there are no annual fees. You get 1.5 miles on every purchase, and you also get a bonus mile match for the first year. So not necessarily like the best travel card, but it's not terrible. That's why I've never covered it. It doesn't have anything special about it in my opinion it's funny because first half i try to make it easier and then the second half is going to be way harder oh great oh great thanks thanks for that really appreciate that guys they're not going to want to buzz in now kelby <laughs> this one is actually pretty easy so it's a pretty color isn't it it's either the saver or the saver one buzz Joshua. Capital One Saver. So Joshua, you do know that there are several versions of this card as well in Capital One fashion. Which version of the Saver card are you going to go with? Well, I believe the Saver one has the one text possibly underneath where mm -hmm. it says Saver. Oh, shit, is that an O on the right? <laughs> we, we, we don't know, so. Capital One Saver. Is oh, he gave one. final answer. Oh boy, here we go. He is right. <laughs> Hell yeah. Good job, Joshua. Good call, Josh. That's what I'm talking about. Nice job, Josh. Coming for you, Stanley. It's crazy because like, I, every time I, I know the card right away, but I just can't buzz in because there's like so many versions of Capital One cards. It's just such a risk. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. All right. This is card number 11. Let me explain the rules for this one. So this is going to be an interesting round. Everyone has to wager at least one point up to any amount of points. And if you win, you get double the points. If you lose, you lose the point or points you wagered. Stanley, you have three points. How many would you like to wager. Oh, I have to wager right now? Yeah. But it's only at risk if you buzz in. No. Okay. Well, I guess I'll wager one point. You got two points, Josh. How many would you like to wager? Stanley is currently at three points wagering one. All in. I'm going to go all in. Oh, he's going to wager all. All right, Matt, you got one point. How would you like to go? I'm going to wager one. All in. I don't think he had a choice. Card number 11. This is going to be pretty hard. As they watch their points disappear, they are looking at the card. <laughs> right hoping to hold on to every point they have. But at this moment, they have realized that it was a mistake. A lapse in judgment. <laughs> All right, we got some words. We got some words. Come on, buzz. Oh, we have a buzz. Wait, wait, wait. Who buzzed in first? Was it Matt or Stan? I'm going to say it was Stan. The Chase Aeroplan card. CJ, is it the Chase Aeroplan card? I don't know how Stanley got that one. I wanted to watch people suffer. <laughs> Slowly. <laughs> Boom! Oh my god. I was gonna guess the same thing. Unreal. All right, so we have Stan at five points right now, and then we have Josh at... Zero. Oh god, zero. Zero points. And then we also have Matt at zero. Remember, the loser has to share their credit score publicly with everybody. All right, because Stanley has such a large lead at five points compared to everybody else at zero, we're gonna shake things up a little bit. There are four cards remaining. Three points per card if you guess it right, and you can only guess once, but you can't lose it if you do guess wrong. Correct. So that means that there are 12 points up for grabs total. Oh, for the last card though, I forgot. We're gonna make it five points. Ooh, that could change change the game. Danley could get last place. Ooh, I like this. Okay. All right, Joshy boy, let's go. <laughs> All right, card number 12, and I don't think anyone will get this. Ooh, I know what it is. Can I tell them? I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I'm going to root for somebody. Who do I want to root for? I'm going to keep it in my head. 
That's what I'll do. No idea what this guy is. No ideas yet? Come on, Josh. Oh, God. <laughs> buzz. Well, we have a buzz with Stan. This is like tough. Um, I'm going to say the AT&T credit card. What do you think, CJ? Do you accept AT&T credit card? I think that Joshua and Matt are really going to have to step their game up because Stan is now at eight points. All right. Like that. Unbelievable. I saw AT&T. I was thinking it was like you're going to have to say some other word after AT&T. For the AT&T Points Plus card is actually pretty interesting. It's ran by City. For the welcome bonus, you get a $100 statement credit after you spend $1,000 in three months. You also get a statement credit every billing cycle you spend $1,000 or $10 after $500 dollars in spend on this card. The multipliers on this card are also pretty good, with three times points for gas, two times on groceries, and one times on everything else. And the icing on the cake is you'll get thank you points instead of AT&T points, if there is such a thing, with no annual fees. That is pretty good. Yeah, it's nice. Card number 13. All right, zooming out. Honestly, I don't, I don't know these cards too well. I think I'm the only one out of this group who made a video on this card. <laughs> I think Eric did too. Buzz. Uh, Stanley, what is your answer? Uh, this is tough, but I'm going to go with the Wells Fargo. Wells Fargo Propel. Wells Fargo. What's it called, Stanley? Active Cash Card. CJ, is it the Wells Fargo Active Cash Card? Stanley, man, how you have fallen from grace. It is not the Active Cash Card. Oh, darn. All right, zoom in out. Oh, good. Here we go. No! Oh! <laughs> Buzz. What is your answer? Wells Fargo Reflect. It absolutely is the Wells Fargo Reflect. Those are my two guesses, and I got it wrong. I buzzed in too early. <laughs> Never heard of this card in my life. The Reflect card is not exciting at all. Kelby can take it from Eric. Basically, the Wells Fargo Reflect, the only thing it is, is a balance transfer card. You get 0% APR for the first 18 months, with an extension of 3 months with on-time minimum payments. I'm surprised you covered this card. I did. I took it from the angle of reading a Wells Fargo buying print and how much time do i have before i am liable wells fargo sucks <laughs> whoa, whoa 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 chill chill it's interesting with these points stanley is still up but up at eight points josh is at three matt i would start getting your screenshot ready <laughs> i'm rooting for you matt but josh could take it if he gets the next two right and actually win so card number 14 uh, I think Matt knows this one. Buzz. We have Stan. I buzzed in too early, but I'm going to take it. I know. Okay. I'm going to guess the Chase Bonvoy Boundless card. The Chase Boundless. Stanley, that was a very triumphant effort of you, but you failed. Ow. Ooh. Ouch. Oh. Buzz, 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 buzz. Oh, we have Matt. Let's go, Matt. Chase Marriott Bountiful. CJ, is it the Marriott Bountiful? 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 Bootyful? I don't know. Bountiful? Bountiful? It is the whateverful we want to call it. Perfect. Nice job, Matt. Nice. That was awesome. Josh, I would get ready for that screenshot. Um. Remember, this last card is going to be worth five points. Even when zoomed out, I'm not sure if anyone would get it. Taking home the gold. We got slowly zooming out. No pun intended on gold card, by the way. But we only do rose gold over here. Just saying. Okay, CJ. You know <laughs> you know the gold is uh the original is the best color. <laughs> Ugh. I don't think so. You know what? Just for that, I'm gonna take out my rose gold and show it on camera. <laughs> you have it on you? Yes I do. Oh, there, you, there it is. Oh, I'm supposed to be paying attention to see who buzzes in first, huh? That's so much faith I have that someone will get it. <laughs> <laughs> I would not pay attention. I don't think anyone's going to guess until those cards fully zoomed out. I know that they're going to like rush and be like, let me read what's on the card. <laughs> <laughs> right. I should have taken off the words. That would have been interesting. <laughs> they would never get it then. <laughs> right. That would be no chance. No chance. I've never heard of this card. All right. We, we got the, uh, what is it? EMV showing now. Oh, is that what that thing is All called? Right, most of the card is showing. I think so. They still have no idea. All right, we got some words. We're starting to get some words. Who's going to hit the buzzer first? Buzz. We have Stanley. Uh, this is like tough. I'm not going to be able to get this right, but I was going to say the America Express business checking debit card, but I don't think that's right. That is absolutely not correct. I'm going to zoom out a little bit. Now we have Josh and Matt. Remember, Matt could tie up with Stanley. 
if he gets this one. Or Joshua can win. Oh, no, no, he would, he would tie. Yeah, yeah. All right, all right, <laughs> half the words are showing. <laughs> we don't got anything. We don't have anybody <laughs> trying to guess. You're not going to lose a point, guys. Buzz, buzz, buzz. I saw Joshua first. All right, Josh, what is your answer? It's the My GM Rewards card. <laughs> oh, I, I don't know how you would have guessed it. So, Matt, unfortunately, you're going to have to show your credit score to everybody. Gotcha. And for Stanley and Josh, since we have a tie, we're going to try to find a tiebreaker for you. I'll be back. All right, this is going to be one for the marbles. We're going to decide who comes first. And also, CJ chose the special prize. So can we get some guesses on what CJ chose out for you? I think he got us a, a plaque. A plaque is very classy, maybe. I'm going to go with a t-shirt. Very, very interesting choices. All right, this one's for the marbles. Whether Stanley or Josh gets CJ's secret special prize. Very secret. There you go. It's funny, if you guys tuned into the live stream, who would have known about this card? Ooh, shots fired. Ooh. <laughs> I don't really care. That live stream is just fun. Buzz. Josh, what's your answer? The WWE credit card. <laughs> what the? F How did you get that? <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> he knows the logo. Well, I have this card. What? What? Oh, credit one. Oh, why did you feature credit one? They don't even deserve your time on the show. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I don't have it. This is a terrible card. So, Kelby, the guy who ended up making history by starting out basically with a negative one. Right. Ended up coming back and winning. What? Started at the bottom, now I'm here. You know what I'm saying? All right, CJ, we're going to show Josh his prize. And it's a lovely prize. CJ personally picked out. It is amazing. Oh, I, I'm sure I will. This is your prize, Josh. Okay. What, what am I looking at? <laughs> 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 Wait, what? What do you mean, what are you looking at? You're looking at the most amazing prize ever. I feel so insulted. If you don't put this on one of your most used cards, we're going to cry. Well, I will. Put it on a card that looks like not great. <laughs>